Introducing first, the woman fighting out of the blue corner, a dangerous MMA fighter who represents American top team. Originally from Sao Paulo, Brazil, Stella Nunes. Her opponent awaits and fights on a third red corner. She represents Tiger and Dragon and fights out of Coral Springs, Florida. Kristen Frohle! Curiously, as it is as cold as it is outside, I wonder if that actually helps the fighters a little bit because you have that cool breeze. It's not that 80, 90 degrees that it's usually outside here in South Florida. Yes and no. Oh! You gotta warm up. You gotta come here warmed up. You saw Marcus Grimmage doing some dog poses because you have to keep your body warmed up. You don't want to pull a hamstring in there. When it's cold, you have more of an opportunity. I take him as as I pull my hamstring out of the cold. So no, uh, you want to be, you like that humidity actually. You want to be able to be fluid and your muscles not cramping up. Not too hot, of course, but you have to be able to really keep your body warm. So of course, Prolic with the pink pillow and Nunez with the blue pillow. We're at the center of the ring, squaring each other up, and Nunez with a swing to the body of Frolic. Frolic trying to get inside, but Nunez says, no, not so fast. And here comes Nunez throwing another haymaker with that pillow. Hasn't found an opportunity to do so. Nunez knows how to Oh, she goes. She landed nicely with a 360 degree move. Nunez certainly the quicker of the two fighters. She's showing that right now here in the ring. As Froelich still trying to get her footing and gets a pop right to the face with that pillow. Kind of winning this, she has this to match. Move. She can't she can't stay stiff. She can't. Nunez is a very experienced fighter. And Nunez again just coming out swinging and another 360 move. Yeah. And Froelich Look at that. is stunned by that hit and then gets hit in the leg. And Froelich kind of loses her footing for a moment before getting her balance yeah. back. Froelich put both her hands and she's wanting to fly. Uh, you know, you know Another attempted flying pillow shot. Frohle following through. Another shot for Frohle. Welcome them with a 360 degree move. Now she's showboating now. She feels very confident. She feels she wants this stuff. Nunez, of course, as we said, a very experienced fighter. Nonetheless, she fought in UFC as well, so no stranger to the ring. And she is not intimidated by any of these ladies. There's another wild 360 miss, though, there by Nunez, as Froelich looking really tired now. And you can tell by the swings that she's throwing at Nunez that it's just not connected. You know, funny you mentioned that, Ryan, because it is a strategy to compete in a ring compared to an octagon or a cage, especially in a ring. So you want to bring your opponent to your corner so you're able to hear your corner man or woman for this instance. Nunez again just trying to block all those shots from Frolic and doing a pretty good job as Frolic again trying to get in there on Nunez but not having much luck and Nunez continuing to attack Frolic right now. Frolic just doesn't want it. And that is going to end the match against Frolic and Nunez. We go to the judges' scorecards. Your winner by unanimous decision, advancing to the women's semifinals. In the blue corner, it's Stella Dunez.